Good morning, CFFs. Good morning, my Christian friends and family. How are you guys doing on this Friday? It is early morning here, and I wanted, before I started my day and got busy, um, I wanted to share some happy mail with you all. And I'm so excited about this. I've already opened it. I've already taken a look at it. Um, but I thought I would come on and share this with everyone. Um, my uh, new little binder. Well, let's before we get into it, how are you guys doing? I hope your morning is going great. I hope you your day will go beautifully blessed and all the love, joy, peace, and happiness, and all of God's goodness be upon your day. <laughs> I am so excited. I got this yesterday. I seen this, and I wasn't sure if I wanted to order it or not. I kind of thought about it, prayed about it, and then I said, okay, I'm going to go ahead and purchase it. And so... um yeah, let me go ahead and get this open. Um, the weather here in the Central Valley is um, not cold, but not. it's definitely not hot. It's a little bite in the air, uh, so you do need a little light jacket on. We're supposed to have rain uh, this evening, so I'm going to get out, do my little last-minute shopping. I did my shopping yesterday. Oh my God, the stores is a nightmare, but uh, did my shopping yesterday and then today um, I have to run out for some last minute things. It's like once I start baking um, and cooking, I don't want to stop to have to run to the store. So yes, I went through my cabinets, my cupboards, and I wrote down everything and I forgot two things. <laughs> Two things, it just goes to show you, no matter how organized you are, no matter how well you plan things, something always pops up. So I had two little things, and I am so excited because my no spend month went, uh, $241, went with what I was saving for my Thanksgiving day. And so I am happy to say, not only did I not go over budget, I had about 70, no, no, about, I'm going to say $55 left over. So I'm going to put that towards my next Thanksgiving. And um, I'm changing up some things with my challenges. As you know, I don't do my budget on camera. But um, yeah, I've decided that I wanted to change up how I do my challenges. I don't want to become stressed out doing them. And I don't want to have so many going on that I just can't, you know, fulfill all of them. I want to complete a challenge. So as I complete them, I will add a new challenge to it. Um, so I'm going to do a video on all of that. Um, that will be coming up um, in a week or so. So, but on to my happy mail. And it has it right there. Happy mail. <laughs> And this is from Butterfly. I'm not sure if you guys can see this. This is from Butterfly. Let me see. Butterfly Digital Co. So let's open it. Let's open it. I was so excited to get this. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. First of all, I love the packaging. Okay, I tried to put it back because I did open it and I went through it. And look at the little freebies I got. Oh, so, <laughs> this is so cute. First, it says, hello, Rose. Thank you so much for your order. I really appreciate you supporting my small business. My goal is to create products that will help you save to save money in a fun and easy way. Please feel free to message me as I love to hear about your saving progress. And remember to celebrate your progress each um, each step of the way. Um, so here we are, butterfly, and she's got 
two scratches to scratch and save. So I love that. And then I'm going to save this for last. Um, well, for next. <laughs> then I have a pen that she sent. If I can get it out. Okay. I love this. Look at this. It opens there. And let me take that off. And then it becomes a highlighter. I I just love this. So anyway. Yeah. This is so cute. <laughs> I'll be using this with, with this. So. And then. Um, after that. I never use these. I never, you know, I see a lot of people have them on their binder. But talk about bling. Look at this. Is this not gorgeous? Look at that. That is gorgeous. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So let's get into the book. Um, I seen her... Um, talk about this on her YouTube channel and which is Butterfly Digital Co. Um, and the Saving Butterfly Challenge book. And you open it up and it's packaged so nice. So, so nice. I am so excited to get this going. You guys have no idea. And so here's the envelopes that come with your with your book. And it is so nice. So we have emergency savings, 12 month savings, daily savings, oh so many savings, <laughs> inspired to save, the saving butterfly, and holiday savings. So um once I get everything set up and lined out of what I'm going to do with my savings, I'm going to do a video on it. I was waiting for this to come. And it got here yesterday and I was so excited. Look at this bubble wrap. The kids like to play with this. <laughs> ah, that's cute. Okay. And here we are, guys. Look, what a well thought out challenge book. The Saving Butterfly Challenge book includes 80 fun saving challenges, over $50,000 in challenges. And it's by Butterfly Digital Co. And then you open the book, and I hope you guys can see all this. And it says, this book belongs to, and then it gives you a thank you for purchasing. Then the table of contents. Here's the page. And then you go to the emergency savings. This, uh, I must say that for me, um, this was such a well thought out um, challenge book. I couldn't help but to just say, you know what, I want it. But I'm I'm gonna go through um, real quickly the pages, and then when I do the video, uh, the video of what I what challenges I decided to do, uh, I empty out my other challenges. I put that in the bank, and so now I'm getting ready for January. So this month, I'm going to save on a couple of challenges that I'm really trying to build up and um, next month, but that's going to be it for the year for me. And then starting January, I'm going to implement my new challenge um, um, challenges that I'm going to be uh, saving for. So here we go. Emergency savings. I never like to say emergency, but um, here it is. A starter emergency fund. So, and it has uh, butterflies on there. I'll let you guys see that. And it's different amounts. 5, 10, 20, 25, uh, 40, 
there's different amounts on there. And then it tells you the instructions, the month ahead instructions. And then she gives you the monthly bill expenses, which I will be filling that out. And then um, there's one, two, three, four, four pages of that. And then the month ahead instructions. And that's what I like about this. She included instructions. If you're a first time beginner on challenges, savings, um, this planner, or I should say this um, challenge book is so well thought out and laid out. Anyone can use it. If you're on a, a very tight budget and you're just doing small amounts, this is good. If you want to save big and you can, you're able to save more, this book is good. It hits every level of saving and I love it. And then, um, step two, uh, month ahead saving plan so you can budget out your savings plans of what you're going to do um, and then the little butterfly tracker um, as you can see I am a month ahead um, and then you can just start here and start date end date you guys see that and then your goal amount and then you just Color in the lines as you hit that 100%. Um, and she gives you examples. So, yeah. And then home month ahead saving tracker. Let me put this down. And this is another thing I really appreciate about this book is that she left the page behind it blank. So you can go in, you can make notes to yourself. You, I really, really like that. Really, really... As I said, a very well thought out book um, of challenges. So your home month ahead saving tracker, transportation month ahead saving tracker. And I, um, really and truthfully, I can tell you, I this will be in my plan because I'm planning on purchasing a new car, but I do not want to have a high payment. So that means I need a bigger down payment. So, yeah, this is my goal for next year. Um, food, month ahead. Utilities, a month ahead. Insurance, a month ahead. I definitely want to use that. Um, I'm going to tag each one that I want to use, and then I'm going to use my A6 binders um, to put my envelopes in there for um, well, the pages that I'm using. And each page is numbered. So, okay, so your insurance, um, whether it's home, it's auto, whatever insurance it is, um, this is there to help you manage and, and keep track. Kids month ahead, entertainment month ahead, miscellaneous this is so important because there's those little things that you might not catch when you first start and you definitely want to catch them so miscellaneous is is good one month ahead emergency savings three months ahead six months ahead nine months ahead and 12 months um savings tracker and i love that so this is each section and section off and this is your emergency savings and this is your 12 month saving plan and there's so many here like i said no matter how you're saving whether you're saving a little or you're saving a lot you you're able to use this book she really thought it out really well um, 12 months of saving challenge complete and save a thousand and there's january through december um, change it up uh, savings color and save and a little two dollars that's why I say anyone can use um, can use this book um, 52 week challenge you can do that 26 weeks challenge there's the 52 week retirement 26 week retirement 
And then she has January Savings Challenge. And then February. You guys see, let me hold it up. February Saving Challenge. There's March Savings Challenge. Here is April. I, I definitely want to do April because that's my birthday month. <laughs> it's an April Saving Challenge. And then here's May. Isn't that cute? There's May. And then here is June. Here is July. Look at the flowers. How pretty. Like Hawaiian City. <laughs> and August Savings Challenge. September. October, which I love because she has um, fall things on there. And I love that. This is October Savings Challenge. November. Look at the fall trees. and Oh, it's so pretty. And um, she has the amount on here and you complete and save $100. So if you don't want to use the the more high dollar uh, challenges, you can come and use the smaller ones. That's why I say it was well thought out. Um, there's December saving challenges, $75. So, and that was the 12 month saving challenge. So you can do a high dollar, you can do a small dollar. It's up to you. Days of saving. I am progressing every day. And as you save, you really are. Why do you say, I save because I got tired of being broke. And I got tired of going from one, one paycheck, waiting for the next paycheck, with that paycheck already gone. I said, I'm tired of this. <laughs> I need to do better. Especially for someone me, like me, working in uh, accounting, um, collections and all that stuff and it's like do better Rose come on do better so she gives you instructions for the no spin challenge which I really love and each month you can pick a, a few days that you don't spend um, October and February are my no spin months October because it's just before the holidays if I don't spend I total up what I would have spent, or uh, I take a look back at what I have spent, and I just kind of add that up for what I don't. If I don't go to Starbucks, I include that. If I don't run out and eat out, I include that. Whatever it is that I may do um, through the month that I normally do, I add that money to my no-spend month, and I use it for my shopping uh, for Thanksgiving and Christmas. So, so no month, uh, no spend challenge. And you can pick the month and no spend, your total number of no spends. Then she has saving challenge, money dump. <laughs> Each day, save an amount of money that you choose. Write the amount in the box for each day. Money dump. I like that. <laughs> and then at the end of the month, write down the total that you saved. And there's one page, two page, three, four pages of money dump. And then there's um, save, save a day. Save $150 in 31 days. Very achievable things. And there's one. This, these two are for 150. This is for 300. This is for 300. And then your daily coin change. Isn't that cute? 50 cents, 75 cents, a dollar, 375. So if you um, don't want to do the high dollar, you can do the smaller ones. And... That's $100 in 
by simply saving change. Um, look at that, $100 in 31 days. You can do it, you can do it. And it's all about not depriving yourself, but some days saying, because I, you know, have blood pressure problems and stuff like that, I choose not to always go to Starbucks. So the days that I really want Starbucks, I can reward myself by having a Starbucks, or I can reward myself by going here and say, I'm going to save that $3.75 or that $5.75. Usually when I go to Starbucks, it's $7.00. So I can save five seventy five, and then, oh, and she even has a seven dollar one on here. So maybe that day I choose to not do Starbucks, and I put that seven dollars into my daily coin challenge. And instead of doing Starbucks, I take a walk. I think about my health as I say. <laughs> Does that make sense? <laughs> okay. Well. Here we go. Daily coin challenge. And it's a hundred dollars in the month, and you have three pages. Also, many savings. I am reaching my goals. Yes, that's what I want to do. This is so cute. Saving to the beat. And she has the music notes on there and different amounts. And once you color and save, that's a hundred dollars. And it's like four, five dollars, six dollars. Um, very attainable savings goals. So she really thought about it, everyone um, doing this book. And here we go. Complete each planner set. <clears throat> it's a plan saving challenge. And I really like this because I am a big planner person. I love my planners, my journals. And so, I see that this, I will be using this so I can save for my planner purchase. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to use that. You could have gave me three pages of that. <laughs> Knockout saving challenge, $200. This is so cute. Follow the savings challenge. Complete and save $300. Food truck mania. So, they got the... Uh, Every once in a while, I do like to go downtown and I like to purchase the Mexican corn from this one truck. And, um, man, they have the best corn. Oh, my goodness. And they have the best cucumber water. So when I go there, that's what I like to get. And I know that's like about $10. I think I spent $10, $12. So... That's a treat to myself. When I've done something good, that's how I treat myself at the food truck. It's a big, um, uh, what do they call it, food court, and all the big trucks are out there. And so I like to go to this one truck. I really like it. It's very clean, very nice. I love going there to purchase uh, my cucumber water and my um, Mexican corn. So good. So, yeah, I need that <laughs> to treat myself. Uh, don't forget to save challenge. Save $500. And that was oh so many, many, many savings. And then the next one section is inspired to save. I am turning my dreams into reality. And save $500. Little piggy. And she has cute little things on there. I can do this. I am abundant. I can. I will. I will reach my goal. I am a saver. There are no limits. Saving is fun. Small progress adds up. Yes, it does. I will reach my goals. I can. I will. And um, it, it starts over again. I am a saver. I will reach my goals. I am abundant. And speaking positive words. Um, I gave that scripture on my last video. If you haven't seen it, go over and check it out. Um, Proverbs 18 and 21. Speak positive. Life and death are in the power of our tongues and we have to speak positivity. Yes, you can do it. 
Will there be obstacles? Yes, there might be, but you can do it. Each little step that you make grows to bigger and better. So never give up. Keep pushing. Keep doing it. Sweet dream saving. Say, use this tracker to save for any dream, wish list, items, or experiences. Great. And then here's a word search. I like word searches. I have books in my room um, on my nightstand that when I'm not catching up on my YouTube videos, I'll take that. They're usually Bible uh, word search. So I'm finding words in there from the Bible or characters from the Bible, um, people from the Bible, Job and Adam and stuff like that. I like that. So, and as you find it, then you get to save whatever um, words that you find, you get to save that. So savings, money, goal, achieve, finance, butterfly, limitless, budgeter, fun, positive, abundant, growth, the dream, mindset, and progress. And so when you find those words, you would just add that amount to it. Cool. And you would save a total of 200. Okay. 10,000 with down payment savings. Here you are getting ready to purchase a home. You need to save up 20,000 for a down payment. Sweet ride savings. She has a, um, a goal in here to save if you're buying a new car. So this is going to go along with the other one that I seen in here. I thought, yes, I need this. My transportation challenge and this is going to get me to my down payment for my new car. And I would really like to do that by the end of next year. Debt destructor challenge. There's little things pay off and as you pay it off. I am so excited because <laughs> I won't have to use this. I, I will be done in February paying off Capital One, which has been a thorn in my side. <laughs> and I can't wait to do it. <laughs> February. So I really won't be using this because I want no more credit cards ever again. If I can't pay cash, I don't want it. I have two small credit cards that I use. And when I use them, I make sure I pay them off before the bill becomes due. So, um, uh, Learned my lesson the hard way. Don't want to get back into that again. And since I'm retired, I don't have money to just throw out there making high dollar payments in interest rates to companies just to use their cards. Sorry. Don't want to do it no more. The savings butterfly. I make smart money moves. And... Sweet fantasy savings. Isn't that cute? Lollipops, cupcakes, cookies. That is so cute. And pouring into me saving self-love. I like this. I'm probably going to use that. Color and save 300. This is grow to save challenge. It's 300. Look at the cute little butterflies. And look, I guess you start here, and they start as a caterpillar, and they go up, and they change into the butterfly. Isn't that cute? There you go. That is so cute. And then they sprout out. Yes, I love that. Oh, love it, love it, love it, love it. So when you complete that, you will then save 300. Pampered Butterfly Savings, Lux Saving Challenge, this is $1,000, and yes, I will be using this because I love purses and I love watches, so yes, I will be using that. <laughs> okay, next is the Holiday Savings, and I like this, I am celebrating my progress. And so, birthday savings, you can save for birthdays. And you have one, two, two pages for that. 
this is definitely going into my uh, challenges so i will be including that vacation complete and save a thousand we have a big family trip coming up and um, next year so i will be doing that vacation savings complete and save three thousand and then here's the holidays valentine's day easter savings mother's day father's day fourth of july savings i don't celebrate halloween but there's halloween for all of you that do i don't like scary stuff <laughs> i'm such a wimp at it i i don't like scary things spooky things so i just i just don't do that <laughs> thanksgiving day and so i have Actually, I'm going to be able to use this real soon because the money that I had left over from my shopping this Thanksgiving, I'm going to add to this for this Thanksgiving. And you'll save $150. Black Friday savings. It's so cute. $500 Christmas challenge. $1,000 Christmas challenge. New Year's savings, complete and save 150, and there you have it. And then um, she has the saving trial challenges tracker. So each challenge that you're going to use, you can put it down here. The date you started, the date you completed, and your total save. And I believe there is one, two, three, four. There's five. And like I say, I appreciate the back pages not having anything on them because then you can go in there and um, jot notes to yourself. Well thought out, well uh, put together challenge book. And it's all you need for challenges. And I really, really like this. And I'm so excited to start this in January. And I am, as I said, I'm rethinking my um, challenge and uh, my budget will stay the same as it has always. But I don't want to overwhelm myself with challenges. So I decided that I'm going to just pick a few challenges. And as I complete them, then I will um, start a new challenge. And so this will be my guide post for it. And I'm going to do a video on um, what I'm doing, my challenges that I'm doing, and everything. Once I get it all lined out, I'm working to um, complete my A6 binders so I can get them fixed and ready to go. And so this book will be my, my guiding tool. So if you haven't been to her channel, go over and check her out, Butterfly Digital Co. And um, this is on Etsy. Go, you can go to Etsy. I'll link it in the uh, description below. You can go to Etsy or you can go to her website right there. You can go to her website and purchase the book there. It's well thought out. It's you, anyone can use it, whether you're saving a little or you're saving a lot. Um, this, um, I should say, this video is not sponsored. It's not a code. We're not doing anything together. I've just seen her doing this on her YouTube channel. I fell in love with it, and I decided it was worth the investment because it's going to pay me back a hundred times more than what I spent for it. So go over, check it out on Etsy or go over to her website and um, pick up your book. Get ready for the new year. I'm telling you, anyone can use this book. Um, whether you're saving for a little, whether you're saving for a lot, she kept everyone in mind and it's it's just a great book. I really love it. So 
thank you guys all for watching. I am so excited about the new year coming and I cannot wait um, to get my challenges underway. And I can't wait to share with you guys the challenges that I will be doing uh, for 2024. Uh, so I'm excited about that. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for taking um, time out of your busy day to come on and listen to me rattle off. But I just, I'm so excited about this book. I couldn't help myself. So I wanted to share. So remember, find three good things in your day. Make your day a good day. Find three good things in your day. Write it in your planner, put it in your journal, write it on a piece of paper, tack it on the wall, your mirror, anywhere that reminds you this was a good spot in your day. Don't focus on the negative. It's too much of that. Show love, positivity, and enjoy life. We only get one, guys. We only get one. Let's enjoy the journey as we go. So focus on three good things in your day. Find them. They're there. Little nuggets that the Lord drops in our way just for us. Something that puts a smile on your face. It warms your heart and it brings joy to your soul. Focus on that. And then after you do that, go out and be the good in someone else's day. Make someone else happy. Put a smile on their face. Bring some warmth to their heart. Give them a little joy. And until next time, bye guys. See ya.